So the idea of Operation Gunnerside is these six men will land, they will join up with Grouse, and then they will move towards the plant. Now there's really three ways they can hit the plant. They can do one, like Operation Freshman, they can cross the single lane suspension bridge, but the trouble is it's been doubly guarded, the Germans are expecting them to come this way, and if they manage to cross this bridge to take out the guards, they had planned on climbing across the wires that held it up and then coming down onto the guards. But there would have been an alert. The element of surprise would have been over. They can come down from the mountains that you see in the background, steep mountains, but manageable. The trouble is it's littered with minefields. There's no way to know what step will be their last. So the saboteurs decide to do the thing that the Germans never expected them to do, the thing that Life Tronset suggested, but these local boys from around Rukon who were on this mission said, we can't do that. And that was to ski down and then climb down the valley, cross the river, and then scale this 500 foot cliff in the middle of the night at the end of February, half scramble, half rock climb, Impossible, seemingly impossible. 